everybody, it's your girl, the man. Today, today, I am sitting here with someone awesome. I am sitting here with none other than the Shonda Harris Muhammad. Shonda, how are you? I am well, sis. How are you? I know uh, it's hard for me to look, say you say I, I believe that we're two or three yes. hours after. The Lord will be praised. There yes. it is. Yes. But look, we're going to do this briefly because the reality is we are not social distancing, but it's okay because we are here for the best cause. Mm -hmm. We are here for the babies. We are here for our babies and your babies. Right. Shonda Harris Muhammad is on flight to become the 6th District Representative for Richmond School Board. Shonda, tell us a little bit about your previous tenure. Absolutely. Absolutely. Good morning, everybody, and happy Mother's Day weekend to all the mothers out there. I hope you all enjoy your weekend. Again, yes, I'm Shonda Harris Muhammad. I am running for the school board to represent the 6th District. Um, I am very excited about this new season in my life. I served as school board representative before from 2012 and 2016. And then at that time when I ran for re-election, I was not um, chosen to serve for the next four years. But I believe that every season is an opportunity to grow, develop, and learn some new things that you need to do to be a, to be a more efficient, effective, and servant leader. So this season, um, the Holy Spirit has brought me back to represent so many of you all. Even though you're, you're running for a district, these roles represent all 24,000 plus students in Richmond City Public Schools. And just to give you a little bit of background about me, this is my 29th year in public education. I serve as an assistant principal and instructional specialist, dual roles in a secondary high school. Um, I, am, I am so embedded in what drives education, that's curriculum, instruction, and assessment. Um, those are the three uh, things that drive instruction for children. And during this season of crises, unprecedented um, outcomes that we have never seen before, we need experienced leaders to drive policy to move more effective instruction that is equitable for all children in Richmond City Public Schools. So with my background of serving in public education for 29 years, and the struggle has been real really? in, public, in, in public education. Um, and what I mean by that is just ensuring that students who, regardless of the zip code from which they reside, are treated and taught with equity, with equity, okay? And that is very serious. So during a time such as this that we are all in, um, we need experienced individuals representing families on the school board. Many of you may may not know, but this is serious. Local politics is serious. Um, you know, when your local elections matter. We are all following what's going on nationally, and wherever you stand with national politics, it's the local politics that drive the policy in your community. So get involved, absolutely. Get involved and ensure that um, what policies are created for all people are equitable, and not just fair, but equitable for the people that we serve. So I'm excited. I'm excited, I'm excited for about the season that I'm in. Absolutely. I really am. And I am looking forward to being on the ballot certified and also um, on November the 3rd, even though that may be a few months away. But I am already walking in the assignments Absolutely. of serving you again as your 6th District School Board representative. It's been a while, but one of the things that I can assure you that I have never been absent. I didn't need to remain on the school board four years ago to continue to do the servant leadership that has been embodied in me. I continue to work. And so I want to um, serve as a school board representative again to make sure that the curriculum, instruction, and assessment is driving Richmond City Public Schools. They're doing good things, but we also can look at policy to do some greater things. And as an educator, I know how to maneuver through those things. So I'm excited for you to have a representative that's going to serve you 
um, from the heart and from the spirit. And if you don't know me, I love kids. And I also have a nonprofit, Northside Coalition for Children Inc., who provides preschool supplies for children regardless of their zip code in Richmond City and surrounding areas. So right now, the scheduled date is August the 1st, depending on the pandemic and where we are. We may have to reschedule that, but right now we're planning to serve around 7,000 students on August the 1st. The location is being solidified right now, so I'll communicate with you all with that will be. I will make sure my sister, Lily, will also communicate that with you. But before I go, share the good news after someone that you know in the 6th District that Shonda Harris Muhammad is running for school board in the 6th District. And guess what? I'm excited about that. Thank you all so very much. Love you. Absolutely, guys. So you heard it directly from Shonda Harris Muhammad herself. Now, let me re-emphasize. Priority, planning, and preparation is what she is all about. And I want to further re-emphasize. National elections are awesome. They are great. But guess what? State and local is what truly matters. Those are the individuals who truly represent you, and you need to tell them how to represent you too. So once again, it's your girl Lily Mae. It's consulting time, and I have been sitting here chopping it up with Shonda Harris Muhammad, November 3rd, November 3rd. If you live in the 6th District, inbox me ASAP. That's Richmond, Virginia, 6th District, inbox me ASAP, and I will make sure you get connected with and I'm, all, I'm on all social media, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, um, Shonda for the Six, and also Shonda Harris Muhammad on Facebook. I don't want to take much more of your time, but ladies and gentlemen who, who are viewing and who will share this with the next person and the next person, be blessed in everything you do. Thank you. Absolutely. 